Hi, um, and welcome to my little tutorial on some basic iMovie effects. So let's go ahead and launch iMovie. Um, and then we go over here. Um, if you're a new iMovie, um, this is the first time you opened up, you're going to have this up here and this down here. Um, but I think it makes a lot more sense if the projects are down here and the clips are up here. So we're going to click this button. That's going to bring it so that all of our projects are on the bottom and all of our clips are on the top. So the first thing we're going to have to do is press Command N. Okay, so the next thing we're going to need to do is type in our project name. I'm going to name mine Fun With Effects. And um, I like to click No Theme because, um, I mean, it depends what you're doing, but right now we're just fooling around, so I'm going to click No Theme. Um, and we're not going to add any um, stuff like that. So we press Create. And it brings us to our editing menu here. Okay, so the first effect I'm going to show you how to do is reverse. So let's go into our iPhoto videos. Um, depending where your videos are, this is where most of mine are right now. So I'm going to click my first clip right here, um, which is a skiing clip. So we're going to select that, and we're going to drag it down into our editing area um, until we click on it. Um, and so. When we click on it, we can open up Inspector. There are two ways to do that. We can either click I right here, or we can literally click I on our keyboard. Not Command I, just click I when you've selected it, and that opens up our Inspector. Um, sometimes if you shoot with an iPhone, it'll be the wrong format, and you have to uh, click Convert Entire Clip. It'll take like 30 seconds, but otherwise you should be fine. Um, so just click Reverse. Um, audio in Reverse sounds really odd, so we're going to go over to the audio tab and drag this all the way to the bottom. So now, let's watch it. Great! Alright, so um, to do split screen in iMovie, we actually use green screen, and that might sound scary at first, but it actually isn't. We're, um, you're not going to actually need a green screen, we're actually just copying, um, sorry, um, cropping, actually, as I just said four times. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to make sure that your camera or your webcam is in the same place the entire time. I'm just going to use my eyesight right now, or FaceTime if you're a newer Mac. Um, not do bad. So you see that line in the window? We need to stay to the left of that line. Um... Okay, so we're going to capture, and we're going to add it to this event, um, or if you want to make a new one. Okay, so capture. I'm going to capture about three or four seconds of this, maybe six. And once that's done, we click stop. Um, so once that's done, um, we're going to do our next. Okay, so now we're going to capture our next bit. Um, we're going to put it in the same event. Except that, oops, wait, hold on, I need to redo that. I need to be to the left, sorry, to the right of this line this time, since I'm in a different person. So I say capture, capture. Um, we need to get roughly five or six seconds of this. So that's about good. Um, so it's going to generate our thumbnail. And once it's done, we press done. Um, okay, so, gosh, I had to redo this a few times, that's why there's so many of you just wondering. Um, so we're going to select our clip, which have been put into here. Um, and once we've selected it, we just drag them down to here. Um, and, okay, so now that that's down here, we need to select our other clip. Um, hold on, how long is this one? This is 627, and this is 6, so we need to make this, um... So if you see this ticker on the right, we need to make that until it goes down to 6. And once it's down to 6, we drag this part over and we delete that little extra part. Um, and then we can drag this down um, and drag it over here until you see the green line. And when you see the green line, make sure you don't drop it because that will put it between them. Go over a bit until the green line disappears then drop. And now what we're going to do is we're going to say green screen. 
um, and it's going to do something for a minute, and then what we need to do is we're going to say cropped. Um, sometimes you're going to need to shoot this in black and white, and I just use photo booth for that, but otherwise you should be fine, um, because of the green screen and the color sometimes messes it up. Um, okay, so then what we do is we put our corners over until it looks right, um, and we click done. And see how you can obviously see the light difference since it was focusing on me in this part? Um, we're going to need to adjust that. Okay, so now what we need to do is to adjust our light balance um, on the left. So we click that, and we go into our inspector by clicking I if you remember that. And we click video. Let's drag our inspector over here. And now what we're going to do is we're going to literally turn up our brightness and, oh, that doesn't look good, does it? Might have to turn down our brightness in the other one. Yeah, that's what we're going to have to do. So um, instead, click the top one, which is surrounded in green, and click that, um, and click video, and we're going to turn down our brightness until that line disappears slightly. Um, you can still kind of see it, but you only have to, you know what I mean? Um, so now we're going to click done, um, and then let's, let's see this. <laughs> See, I'm both talking at the same time. Um, so once that's done, let's do our last one, which is gonna be okay. So to find to make our um video sped up, um, we just let's find a clip that might be good for that. Um, here's one. I oh, know that probably wouldn't. Yeah, that's fine. Um, so we drag over the part that we want. Um, and we drag over and then we click and drag down to here. And once that's done there, we do the same way that we um that we made our our reverse. So we just click I or inspector. Um and we go we just speed this up a couple notches, one. Um and let's go ahead and turn our audio down again. And let's see what's that like. There I come. Whee! That was me, actually. Um, so, that's my little tutorial on um, iMovie effects. And go ahead, make yourself an iMovie, and I'll make some more tutorials. Um, if you want any more tutorials on anything about iMovie or about Mac, and I'll do my best to help you, just email me at kadian.net. I mean, sorry, kadian at kadian.net. Um, and I'll try to get back to you and make a tutorial for you. Um, on my tutorial pages on kadian.net and on my YouTube channel. Alright, please rate, comment, subscribe, and have a great day. Thanks.